I'm sort of looking for my subject matter. That's my ongoing project. And I think that's why I paint. I pretty much start with the sort of just the ground and the ground is sort of irregular. Um, and so as I start applying paint, the paintings naturally will start to diverge in different directions, um, which is, is sort of what I'm looking for. I, don't, I want them all to sort of start getting some sort of individual personality. And once that happens, I can sort of start working on them. I think that really just the big decision is like when a painting's finished. Um, which is really the problematic part of painting for me. And sometimes my paintings go on for years, so I'll work on them. Um, and then suddenly, you know, I'll be, it's, it's great to have a big studio like this um, and have a lot of work up. Uh, I'll be working on a painting and look over and think, oh, that painting's done. Um, or, I'll be working on a painting and think, uh, this painting's about done, and then I'll look over another painting and think, that one I thought was done, it's not done. With the larger painting in the Pam show um, is one of those that, like this, was drawing with white paint. And uh, I sort of was thinking, like, the way clouds move and the change, and you see different images in the cloud. You might see an image and then it's slowly changing. Uh, that pace of that change is definitely something that I was, uh, I've been thinking about a lot. The other paintings are a little bit different impulse. They grow out of a little bit different impulse. I was thinking a lot about uh, Mayan painting um, and using this color, like the red hematite. Um, is the type of paint, and it reminded me of the um, pre-Columbian ceramics that have been sort of aged in the patina, and uh, um, so they're sort of, uh, they're more figurative, I think. Just being in a place where the endeavor of paintings are supported and encouraged is great. And, it, you know, I live in the city, um, in Brooklyn, so being in nature and being, I mean, the Cape's my favorite place, one of my favorite places in the world. So being out here, um, I think is inspiring. Mm -hmm.